Hey guys, um, I'm gonna show you how to make a um, XAT um, chat background like this, an inner chat background. Um, earlier, I showed you how to make a logo like this with Kajitsu Snow text, so you can probably insert it into your uh, background once you've made it and make your chat background look good. Um, I actually used a template for this which I made um, so I'm actually going to give it away to you guys um, and you can just use it and stuff um, yeah so let's start this is what it looks like first so I'm just going to do it so that we're not so I'm just going to use this to start with so I'll get rid when once you've uh, got this it um, once I've given you this when you open it up and you need to watch what I hide basically so all these Stay. Um, right. So. so you're gonna take away this background. This is just one I've used ages ago. Um, so. I've gone to clubpenguin.com and I'm going to take a picture of this. Don't really want to get the game stuff in, so I'm just going to go. Okay, just wait for that. Yeah. Um, Paste that in. Whoops. So that's kind of looking cool right now. You can keep that Kajitsu Snow part in if you want, just at the bottom, but otherwise you can click Control T, hold down Shift, and with your arrow make it go like that. Whoops. Make sure you don't let go until you've let go of the arrow, uh, the let go of move dragging. Gonna go across a bit. Okay. Now you want to Yeah, let's get rid of these. Okay, now that's looking good. Um shape five. You're gonna click control T again. You wanna drag it all to the bottom 
Um, now you want to make the fill 100% and the opacity about 70. No, not 70. Maybe 40. I think 40 is good. Um, now, gonna go to. Well, you're gonna insert your logo, so obviously I'll just copy mine, what I've got here. Just copy all this. Because I actually made it in the background in this document, so I don't have it saved or anything. Now you can either have it like this, so it's under the um, it's under the kind of white blood sort of stuff. Um, so you can either have it on top, so it will look like this. One sec. So it'll look like that, or you can have it on the bottom, so it'll be behind the shape. Um, I think I'll do it behind the shape actually this time. And okay. Now what you're gonna do? You're going to make go to this part. Go to this here. Go to the rounded rectangle tool and just draw. Not draw. Just make something. Control T, drag it along a bit, make it a bit taller. So now that's behind that. Um, let me just see. Where is it? Uh, right. So I want to copy, I'm just going to copy the layer style from this and paste it on here. Yeah, now, now you're going to add the text. So I have a font called, I don't know how to pronounce that actually, but uh, I'm just going to say it, welcome to my chat please follow the rules don't worry it's gone behind just click control A and you can make it smaller over here so not 10 maybe 13 or 14 uh, just add an exclamation mark yeah so that looks good now um, now you want to find these layers so I'll just change this is when I had my old domain penguincheating.com so you can change it to yours if you got one or you can just simply delete the layer and it'll go you don't have to have these ones if you don't want um, that's sort of it that looks quite cool um, oh yeah uh, you want to change the or just find it easier if I just make all these not visible so that I can just work on one layer because I want to make this all silver and stuff so
right you're gonna get this tool and you're gonna select everything or actually hold it quick selection tool make it a bit bigger Select everything. There, that's good. Now you want to go to image adjustments, hue saturation. You can change it, you can make it all cool. So go there. It could be like that. Um, I guess that's sort of like that. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah, that looks good. Now I want to see this. So you can you can keep that bit the same if you want, but I might just Let's go back on. Image adjustment, hue saturation. Not sure if this is going to work. Might not, but it will. Yeah, it didn't work, whatever. Um, so. Move those ones. Okay, image adjustment, hue saturation, and now you do exactly the same. You can make it all silvery. Now you can add everything back. No, not those. Nothing there. There. So that looks good now. Um, yeah. Thanks for watching. Um, this tutorial was actually requested by someone. Um, so feel free to request any tutorials on twitter to me and i'll try and do them if i know how and stuff so yeah thanks for watching bye